The easiest way to add strips to a spectrum display is simply to click on the large plus button on the toolbar. This will add strips consecutively to your display and you can remove them again with minus. Notice that um, each strip has its own so-called strip ID at the top and the strip ID which is highlighted shows that that is the active strip. You can make a strip active simply by clicking in it. Now all the strips have the same y-axis coordinates however they have a separate uh, x-axis and also separate uh, z-axis coordinates. And you can see that the z-axis coordinate shown down here is always that belonging to the active strip. You can make your strips wider or narrower using the buttons at the top of the toolbar. And if you have too many strips or your strips are too wide to display in the spectrum display, you will get a scroll bar at the bottom for you to move through them all. Now you can drag strips to move them, so simply take hold of a strip by its strip ID and then drag it to where you want to place it and drop it there. You can navigate to uh, a strip position uh, from another spectrum display simply by going to navigate to and then select the strip of your choice. Now a perhaps more useful way to create strip plots involves using the make strip plots pop-up. Go to spectrum and make strip plot or SP as shortcut. Here you can select which uh, display you want to be using and then you can select for instance to create strips for a particular NMR chain. So in this case I'm going to choose the A chain which has got a small stretch of assigned residues. And now I've got all my strips and you can see each strip has an additional header with the NMR residue shown uh, to which it belongs, from which it is derived. Alternatively, I could select a number of peaks in another spectrum or I could select peaks in a table and again go to make strip plot and at the same time select use peak selection. And then here I've got um, my strips. Now by default the strips are always shown as vertical strips. But you can also set them to be horizontal if you like. Simply go to the gearbox to open the settings and then at the bottom you can select your strip arrangements. And now you can use horizontal strips. For more information about creating strip plots have a look at our creating strip plots tutorial.